Coming back to the game here, everyone, with example five, a company establishes a sinking fund. And so a sinking fund, to my understanding, is basically a fund where you're like, hey, I know that I've got a huge bill coming. So let's start saving money now so that we can pay that bill uh, once it lands. And so this company is basically preparing to have money available so that they can pay off a giant bill. And this is number five schlegel, so change that. And so they are going to discharge $300,000 to pay a debt due in five years by making equal semi-annual deposits. The first is due in six months. If the deposits are placed in an account that pays 6% compounded semi-annually, what is the size of these deposits? And so we are looking for the size of the payment that will eventually sum to be $300,000. And so the reason that someone would do this, everyone, is to say, because if they wait to pay the, the debt, they're going to have to pay the debt with all of their own money. If they do this and make an investment, they're going to end up paying way less to reach that $300,000 than they would have if they were to just throw out $300,000. And so it's going to be in five years. So our T is five semi-annual deposits. So twice a year. And if the deposits are placed in an account that pays 6% compounded semi-annually. So the rate is 0 0.06. I is R over M. N is MT. 0 0.06 over 2. So 0 0.03. MT is 2 times 5. So 10, and we have our formula. This is an annuity. And so our S is 300,000. Our R is what we don't know, the size of the payment. One plus I is 0 0.03. N is 10 and I is 0 0.03. So given that to Wolfram, everyone, we can figure out how much the size of the payments this company needs to make is going to be. And so 300,000. I already know that Wolfram is not going to like that R, so I'm changing it to an X right now. I is 0 0.03. N is 10. And then I again is 0 0.03. So as I mentioned earlier, Wolfram is not going to finish solving this for me. So I need to take that 300,000 and divide it by 11.4639. And I didn't put the division bar. Oh, well. There we go. And so they need to make semi-annual payments of 26,000. Uh, so R is 26,000, $169 and 10 cents. So the payments must be 26,169 and 10 cents. And I'm actually going to add to this question, everyone, and I'm going to add a question. How much does this save the company? Because why would you do it if it's not going to save you money? And so let's go ahead and do the math for that. We would have $26,169.10 paid into an account twice a year for five years. That would um, get us to um, $261,000. 60 691 dollars and so the company pays in 261,690 dollars to get 300,000 to pay the bill. This saves them uh, 
Uh, it looks like about 28,000. I'm just going to, I'm not going to do the exact numbers, everyone, because that's not something that's super important to me. I'm going to say it saves them about 28,000 bucks. So knowing that the bill was coming, preparing for it by putting money in the investment uh, four or five years ends up uh, saving this company just over 28,000 bucks. So that was definitely a good idea.